Good morning, Minister. Can we ask you Now, I trust that an agreement will be in the offing in the next days, mostly weeks. However, while we are confident of such an agreement, it is particularly useful to ask why has it taken so long? Fruitless recriminations aside, one tangible reason that I want to put to you is that all sides, our side, the other side, have been focusing too much on the strings to be attached to the next liquidity injection to the Greek economy, and not sufficiently on a vision of how Greece can recover and develop sustainably. One of the uh, concerns I heard from a number of people there... Um... We are certainly intending to pay the IMF, and we will pay the IMF. If you're asking me to prognosticate what the Eurogroup of next Monday is going to come up with, you will excuse me if I refuse to do it. Because the whole point about democratic processes and these negotiations is that they're indeterminate and that no one party has the right to impose upon the rest, to impose up, upon the rest uh, his or her expectations or wishes. It is absurd that we should allow a common currency to divide peoples like the Greeks and the Germans who have been coming together over decades. It is absurd that the Greeks should blame the Germans and that the Germans should stereotype the Greeks as if it were ever possible that all the grasshoppers move to the south of Europe and all the ants live in the north.